You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. Well, our next story is on a resident who made a 6,000-mile journey just to live here within the township. His name is Waller and Ezin, and he shared with us his reason and experiences on moving from West Africa to West Bloomfield. As a financial advisor, activist, and resident in West Bloomfield, Walrand Azin is your everyday success story. Born in Benin, West Africa, neighbor to Nigeria, Walrand has seen and experienced a lot. I'm from Benin, West Africa, so that's where I was born. The city I was born in is called Cotonou. I, I came by myself. It was just me and me alone. Uh, I, I can't recall what age, but I probably was about 24. With the intention of continuing his studies of software design and development, he moved to the United States and attended the University of Detroit Mercy, where he obtained his master's in computer information systems. But the cultural transition was a bit more challenging than he anticipated. The reality there is, is extremely different. From a cultural standpoint, uh, I would say even the, the way people dress. You know, we have like traditional garments over there that you, know, you, you wouldn't have here. Uh, in part because of the weather, you know, the weather is much warmer over there, so the silk and everything that we, we wear is very, very light. Since his big move to Michigan, Walrin has made a name for himself as a financial advisor, and he credits his success to his schooling, his attitude, and the clientele within West Bloomfield. Walrin finds it important to give back to today's youth by making them aware of financial stability. He visits schools in the West Bloomfield area, Romulus, and even the inner cities of Detroit's working finance into everyday curriculums. The more I've been, the longer I've, I've been a financial advisor, the more I realize that, even with myself, I realize that my, my ability to manage money uh, would have been even enhanced if I had started, you know, at a younger age, because uh, there's a lot of things that I would naturally know, like instincts that I would naturally have, like investing, you know, uh, have a sense of... Um, of markets, opportunities, you know, all those things, they're better developed when you start early. The move to the U.S. exposed him to a world that he has never experienced and he plans on furthering his knowledge in his line of work so that he can eventually pass it on to his two sons. Well, yes, definitely, I would say that my dream <laughs> probably did come true, like uh, getting to learn a lot and it got, probably even get ex got expanded. And I have my own children with my wife, so it's also a whole new set of learning, you know, that uh, we have. For The Splash, I'm David Glazer. Quite the inspiration. Thanks so much to Walleran for talking with us. And if you'd like to hear more of his story, you can go to civiccentertv.com slash Africa to West Bloomfield. Thanks for watching a segment of The Splash. To catch the entire show or other segments, watch us on Comcast Channel 15 or AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us on WBLD 89.3, the all-new Lakes FM.